hello guys welcome back once again to my channel um today i'm going to do a request that had been asked for me to do that it's uh, a reading for the actor lee sung gi and the actress lee da in that i believe that they are dating at the moment and from what I, I I think I I I saw something about that actually that there was like this huge drama because uh, of her family matters and probably some kind of illegal activities. Um, so let's see how this affects their bond or what's their view about this and the future of their relationship. Uh, remember that this uh, that these readings are for entertainment purposes only, and that are uh, are just uh, an interpretation, and uh, that they are allegedly. So they are not. Uh, just take it with a grain of salt. So let's let's see what the tarot has to say about it. I place him on the left, and he got the card of justice, the moon, and the tower. So, I'm sorry, it's not the card of justice. It's the card of the Hierophant. Um, so, definitely, there's there's a bit of, of uncertainty when it comes to how he feels about this relationship. I think that the, he does fear um, the impact of this uh, relationship in his in his career. Uh, I believe that also he's very traditional. He's someone that is very responsible, that is very hardworking, and 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 always tries to do what's right. I think that uh, I believe he is a Capricorn, and that she is a Scorpio sun. So I see definitely that he is the kind of guy that likes to play by the book, by the rules. He's very respectful. He's very um, um, he um, he values traditions. So I think that maybe with this Harry Fund here, also what he's talking about is this idea of getting married or or like uh, starting like some kind of formal. A relationship with her and there are some doubts about it he definitely has a lot of inner fears uh, insecurities um, and I think that definitely this is not this is not how he feels about her this is how he views the, the situation around her um, I think he knows that if he decides to go through with this decision of probably marrying her um it will have like some kind of devastating and pretty much hard uh, consequences on his person and also on his uh probably on his stability uh, on his professionalism um and on his career i think that he is someone that uh, that doesn't usually um behaves like uh rec recklessly he is someone that thinks a lot about the future he thinks a lot about the consequences of things but at the same time there's a part of him that he really uh he really loves her he really has feelings for her so i think that actually what is bothering him is not uh, the authenticity of their bond it's actually what the public has to say about it so i think that this is why he he wants to be probably a bit more spontaneous when it comes to uh, how he is going to um to act uh, but definitely he knows that um that there will be consequences this is why he's fearing the most and i think that also this uh this um talks about that probably he's been having like trouble sleeping or concentrating because he's a bit worried about the consequences of uh being uh in being in a formal relationship uh with her 
I don't know if probably if he had like some kind of warning or someone had sent him like uh, negative emails or, or letters or something of a sort that it's very negative and that somehow has Im impacted him and has like <clears throat> affected his um, his inner peace. It's like he feels uh, a bit remorseful, he feels guilty, uh, he has a lot of fears. I think that he fears for her safety, uh, so this is why he feels like things are getting out of control, but at the same time, he also finds this very... Um, like, it has to happen anyway, you know, like, like this is like a, a very... A, a kind of... Uh, distraction not distraction uh uh a kind of um it's a break it's a it's a transformation it's a it's like the let a tower moment is when things cannot lo no longer stay in the same way and that sometimes all the structures must fall and must die in order to create new ones. So I think that <clears throat> for him, yes, it's a very risky move. But at the same time, I think that he feels uh, that he had been doing everything right. Uh, he had always tried to stay respectful and he had always been really... Um, really hardworking and really like having this very strong and stable mentality. So of course that he feels that now, even though he fears and he has like some kind of uh, uncertainty inside of him because he he's not he's not good doing well. He's actually thinking a lot. He's having nightmares. So, uh, but at the same time, he knows that this is about him and her. So. I, I think that there's also this realization that if people want to, um, if people want to like, uh, like, I don't know, cancel him or being like, uh, I don't know, uh, taking away their love or their admiration for his work, he will be like, okay, I'll take it because there are some things that need to happen. It's like this is very tra a transformational moment in the sense that sometimes uh, fans uh, need to know where they stand when 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 it comes to um, how much they get a say in 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 in, in a celebrity's uh, lifestyle. It's like you can. Um, have your own opinions about what's right for him to do but at the end he is the owner of himself he is his own person so um i think that sometimes um um it's like you are not judging him for his performance or for his work you are judging him for his lifeless choices so i think that he definitely needs to he doesn't want to apologize. He doesn't want to live his life apologizing uh, for being honest or being being true to himself or finding like a good something that makes him feel good and make him make for him is important. That I believe is her bond with her. Um, I think that he had been feeling really lonely. I think that his lifestyle probably, since he's always been so righteous or so um, so committed to his work and so hardworking, he, he had always had these moments where he felt like he wasn't happy or that he wasn't like 100 fulfilled because he was like this perfect kind of person that he felt like he was wearing a mask. So now that mask is falling off and it's falling off in this in this um in this uh, sign of desire like you showing that what you want or what you uh what you cherish and what you want to have here in your life and and and, and well uh, we'll see what what this decision brings but this is how he feels and when it comes to her that I believe that her name is Lida in and uh, she is a Scorpio. Um, 
She got the card of the lovers, the two of pentacles, and the queen of pentacles. So, yes, I think that she she feels like she has to make a decision between probably choosing her family or choosing to be with him. But I think that he cannot be with both. And it also, like, he ha she has to do probably some kind of action that can separate herself from what her family has done uh, or some somehow make some kind of a statement or or an action that actually can prove to to the audience or whoever is interested in the relationship that she really wants to be with uh with Seungi with Lee Seungi um I think that um she feels really really horrible having to to choose between her family and her her love life but i think that uh, people are getting things confused or mixed and this is why she's trying to remain balanced and she's trying to remain calm and she's trying to not get so affected by probably the mean comments because she she's actually of course yes she is someone that had always um um had always uh, enjoyed a very comfortable life she's someone that is very successful she she is wealthy she has like a, a very good financial stability so she and she knows that she she had always had a very comfortable life with luxuries and stuff so I think that somehow she needs to make a clarification probably about her lifestyle and not to be so, probably not so, not to show so much about that material aspect of her life and being a bit more humble. I think that probably people also can like be a bit like offensed, uh, offended by, by the way she probably... Um, shows off her uh, her um, her possessions her material positions so I think that um, I think that 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 she feels a bit torn she feels like she's pulled by different sides but at the same time she also feels a lot of love for him so it's like she will at the end of the day she will choose for love but um, I think that the one that probably feels a bit more uh, unstable right now, like emotionally or probably in his own person, is him. Actually, I don't see her like feeling. Uh, I see her like juggling with between the options and knowing and and planning about what's the best thing to do. But I think that she's also very like stuck in her ways in the sense that she probably is also really used to getting what she wants so I don't see her like actually being worried or being um, so concerned about the situation uh, the way he is I think that he he definitely is more affected by this because of the cards that I'm seeing in the case of her I think that it's it's a matter of her actually adapting herself to these kinds of comments or stuff but I think that I see her very stable I see her also very like uh very in her power it's like she knows who she is she knows her family she she knows everything she is aware of everything but at the same time she is not apologizing to anyone uh but she's also adapting she's waiting for him to tell her what to do or how to act um, I don't know if if they will release like some kind of a statement together or something, but she will she will remain next to him, but really calm. Like there's, I think that there's something about her that she feels like she has nothing to lose. She just have she, she thinks that she's making the right decision. She's also choosing from a place of love, but I don't see her like actually being a bit like remorseful or being like a bit like embarrassed or being like oh my god I mean like uh, um, I feel bad for these accusations I feel bad for what my family did or whatever I don't I don't see it in her I don't see it I see it that she is really comfortable where she is and the cards that came out for the relationship as an overall 
we have the chariot the justice and the knight of swords so yes there will be like a lot of uh, advances when it comes to this relationship uh they will probably yes will face a, a moment of justice uh, or what i like to call divine justice karma so i think that for a while they will have to defend themselves and defend the relationship and probably like uh, the justice will also be involved in this sense in the sense that they will probably have to do like a lot of official documents or statements or 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 getting like legal advices because i think that People will definitely put a lot of resistance, especially when it comes to netizens or when it comes to opinions online. There will be a lot of attacks towards them, but I don't see them like like actually like stopping, like being like, okay, we are no longer together because um because of what the public is saying. Actually, I see them that they they when it comes to their emotions and how they feel, they actually are very uh, committed to each other. So the card that I got, I got from the Romantic Angels Oracle, it got uh, the card of Love Yourself First. And this card talks about that um, your self-respect or the respect that you have for yourself makes you more romantically attractive. So I think that... Uh, this also talks about them actually like standing by themselves and standing by this relationship and defending this relationship because I think that this is about self-love. Uh, this is about them actually doing something for themselves, for the, their own well-being, for uh, their happiness. So I know that there's going to be a lot of resistance and I know that people have their reasons to, to, to think and feel the way they do. But I think that for them, this this act of maintaining their positions and of not backing down uh, is actually about uh, self-love. It's about them uh, remaining strong despite all the, the ads and despite of all the, the people criticism or all the people um, uh, resistance or all the people's opinions against the relationship. I think that this is uh, this uh, this feeling of them like standing strong with with what they want to achieve together as a couple. I think that it's a way of of manifesting that they that they are doing something that has to do from a place of what makes them happy and actually that they are really happy in this relationship and that this relationship is is actually tell, teaching them how to love themselves as human, as individuals and not only as celebrities. I think that they connected in a very profound way <clears throat> and they feel really devoted to each other. So... Uh, and and I think that they have been like I said before they they've been through a lot of moments of solitude a lot of moments where they felt lonely a lot of moments where they felt like they couldn't enjoy what they were doing and then when they met it's like that the, that initial spark and that uh, passion connection that they have is like they started to feel alive again so I think for them this this definitely this bond is very special and it's something that they want to cherish and it's something that they want to to protect even though they know that people have their own opinions and that probably they will lose a lot in the way and in the process but this is how they feel today so this is all i have for these two actors i hope that you enjoyed it and if you did please give it a like and I would love to hear your feedback uh, from you guys because I know nothing about these two actors, but I was seeing that they were like uh, in different uh, in different uh, videos. Uh, I was watching everyone talking about them, so I was like, "Oh, wow! Well, this really must be like a really like oh a scandal, or it must be like something serious here." So. Um, of course, guys, that uh, this is not uh, my reading is very uh, objective. I'm not what I'm interpreting here has nothing to do with my personal opinion about the situation. I know that um, there are a lot of victims of uh, some 
kind of uh, some kind of actions that her family did and that it affected a lot of people so i understand and i'm not taking sides but this is how i feel when when i read the tarot so i will see you in the next video guys thank you for being here bye